If there was still a question about Khabib Nurmagomedov's greatness, there isn't one anymore after UFC 254. But according to the Eagle, his dominant victory over the interim champ Justin Gagey will be his last. Going into the main event, UFC President Dana White made it clear just what was at stake, and both champs were ready to put their legacies on the line. Habib is, is looking down the barrel of, you know, not only the greatest to ever do it in, in this division, but he's, he's looking, I, listen, I think if he beats, if he beats Justin on Saturday, he's, he's the number one pound for pound fighter in the world and uh, he's, he's on his way to GOAT status. And it's always difficult when you have fight, when you have cut weight, when you have so much pressure on your, on your shoulder, you know. It's always difficult. It's never been it's like easy, you know. I'm a performer. Um, I always show up under the lights, um, and I, you know, that's what I do. I've been doing this as long as he has. We've been, this is ingrained in us. And on Saturday night, I will, you know, leave everything, give everything, and, you know, be proud of my performance. Gagey cracked the champ with a round of his trademark brutal hooks and constant leg kicks. But nothing could stop the inevitable takedown and submission, which is even more remarkable given Khabib's nightmare year. What this guy's been through, we're all lucky that we got to see him fight tonight. Um, and I'm hearing rumors of, of other things that I didn't know about that you guys will hear about when he comes out later, I'm sure. Apparently, he was in the hospital. He broke his foot three weeks ago. That's what his corner was telling me. With the recent loss of his father and trainer, Abdulmanab, Khabib's early retirement didn't come as a complete surprise. But even if he has cut his own career short, it's hard to argue with his place in history. Nurmagomedov's four victories in UFC lightweight title fights ties the divisional record. And he's the only fighter to win three consecutive UFC title fights by submission. He also has the second longest winning streak in UFC history with 13 and he's now the only UFC champ to retire undefeated. He is one of the toughest human beings on the planet, and he is just, he's the number one pound for pound fighter in the world, and, and seriously, you have to start putting him up there at GOAT status with, you know, whoever else you think is the GOAT. Nurmagomedov took home an extra 50K performance bonus. The former middleweight champ Robert Whitaker might have lined up a rematch with the champ Israel Adesanya, Magomed Ankalaev won the other bonus, and Casey Kenny and Nathaniel Wood took fight of the night. Thanks for watching, and remember, if you want more fight sports in your life, just hit the subscribe button.